Elmore Leonard is one of the most successful detective novelists of all time. Se several of his best-selling books, including Get Shorty, Be Cool, and Jackie Brown, were turned into successful Hollywood movies as well. Though he died in 2013, Mr. Leonard left us with 10 rules for writing that will serve us nicely with any type of writing that we do. Here is a short summary of the principles that made Elmore Leonard such a successful writer with my own elaboration on several of the points. Okay, number one, never open a book with weather. Now, not to be taken literally, of course, this rule suggests that we not be mundane or commonplace at the start of a piece of writing. Two, avoid prologues. They tend to be historical or an attempt to foreshadow. In either case, they are apt to feel disconnected from the first few sections of our writing. Three, never use a verb other than said to carry dialogue. When writers use different attributions such as uh, the verbs explained, observed, commented, remarked, intoned, and so on, they draw attention to the attribution and that detracts from the dialogue. Four, never use an adverb to modify the verb said, such as he said gravely. Five, keep your exclamation points under control. Use only two or three per hundred thousand words of prose, if that. Six, never use the word suddenly or the phrase all hell broke loose. To say suddenly indicates that your writing uh, has not made the suddenness of the event obvious. And all hell broke loose, like so many other phrases that we use, is, is really a cliche. Seven, use regional dialect sparingly. If you use it liberally, you will stress your reader's patience. Eight, avoid detailed descriptions of characters. A mark or two of distinction is what makes a character. Let the reader fill out the rest of the character. After all, one of the major advantages we have as, as writers is compared with movies is that writing gives people an opportunity to participate in creating characters and scenes through their imagination. Nine, don't go into great detail describing places and things. People are more interesting than objects. And again, detailed description stresses the reader's patience and leaves less room for their imagination. 10. Try to leave out the parts that the readers are going to tend to skip. Know when your writing is dull and just leave it out. And then there is the additional rule that serves really as a summary of all of those rules. Almore Leonard was often quoted saying, if it sounds like writing, I rewrite it. Good advice.